Hey guys, this is Shukesh Banik from Gadgets Portal and today I am going to make a hardware and benchmark review on this new Sony Xperia M. As I mentioned before on the unboxing and the hands-on review, this phone has got the best hardware in its class and for only 13,000 rupees that is around 210 USD, what you are getting is unthinkable. The display is a 4 inches TFT display and the quality of this display is not bad, it is quite bright and the color reproduction is also very good. There is a scratch resistant coating on the glass and sometimes I feel that because of this, the display glass does not feel smooth. But after a few days of uses, it will obviously get smoother and it also depends on the moisture in your surroundings. The design, the finish of this phone is flawless and there is also a slight curve at the back of this phone which will give you a good grip of this device and one hand operation of this phone is also very easy. Now the multimedia capability of this Sony Xperia M is also very good, especially the camera is just outstanding for a 13,000 rupees mobile phone. You can visit facebook.com slash gadgets portal for the camera samples and also my website gadgets portal dot in. Now let's quickly talk about the internal hardware that is the CPU, GPU, RAM etc. The processor is 1 GHz dual core crate and the chipset is Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 Plus MSM8627. Both of these are as you know of very premium quality. The GPU is also high end Adreno 305 and this spec is almost similar to Xperia L which is almost 50% pricier than this Xperia M. So this is the best spec you can find on any mobile phone in its class. The model name of this single sim version is C1904 and there is a dual sim version of this Xperia M as well with C2004 model number. The resolution is showing 782 vertically because this bar here is eating up some 72 pixels. The Android version is 4.1.2 and the RAM is 1GB. The internal space is only 2GB user accessible. The battery on this phone is of 1750mAh which is just great for a phone with this display size and this spec. I am easily getting one full day with heavy uses. So this is very decent and here are the sensors on this phone. It has got both proximity and ambient light sensors. This phone also features magnetic field sensor that is compass. Let me give you a demo of the compass. This will help you in navigation and it is working smoothly. Now I am going to show you the multi-touch capability of this phone. This phone can detect up to 5 fingers simultaneously and this is an upgrade from the 4 point multi-touch of mid-range Xperia devices. The loudspeaker on this Xperia M is extremely loud and it is also quite clear. Most of the smartphones nowadays feature very poor quality loudspeakers but this one has got a loud one. So the camera, the loudspeaker, each and every part of this phone is very decent. There is an LED notification light here and it is multicolored and changes in accordance with the major color of the images in the gallery. You can also set different colors for different type of notifications. Now let's run the benchmarks and Xperia M has also got these very nice small apps. Check the unboxing and the full in-depth review for a full demo of this interface. Well, I have got 4033 on Quadrant Standard which is very good for a phone with this price tag. Galaxy Core got only 2788 on this benchmark so this is a much better phone than Galaxy Core. Let's now run this Nina Mark 2 benchmark. Well, I have got 64.7 APS which is 
ridiculous because 60 fps is the perfect score so the gpu performance of this phone is just great let's quickly check the antutu benchmark as well As you can see the total score is almost near to the 10,000 mark. I have actually installed a lot of high graphics games into this phone. That's why the result is a little bit low than the original but still it is very good. You can check the breakup here. The 3D graphics has got outstanding result and CPU score is also decent. Overall this Sony Xperia M is a very fast phone applications open very fast and the touch sensitivity is also the best you can get on any mobile phone if you are planning to buy your first android phone then at least get this one it is a full featured smartphone with all the features you need on an android device subscribe and keep in touch with this channel because i will upload more videos on this xperia m very soon that's all for now thanks for watching Thank you.